Before the light of the gods entered the world, there was only darkness ruled by titans. After an epic war, Zeus seized the heavens and exiled the titans, seeking to imprison them for all eternity. The lands were cleansed and mortals flourished, but arrogance precedes many a fall, and even a god's prison may be breached. How's everybody doing? This is the Wolfman, and this is going to be uh, Titan's Quest. I am uh, going to be co-oping this with, as uh, as I said in my announcements, I'm going to be co-oping this with the TK Force. And uh, this is my first time really going through it. I've gotten a portion of the way through the Act 1, but that was a long time ago, and <laughs> this is I'm going to be experiencing the game as you all do from watching it if you've never played the game before. So, you've made it. Far into this. You've beaten the game though, right, TK? I have, I have. And for those watching on my channel, greetings, nature lovers. This is the TK Force, as he mentioned previously. <laughs> uh, and today I'm going to be playing Titan's Quest. And as you just heard from my uh, co op partner's intro, I'm playing with the Wolfman. <laughs> I still haven't done that yet. I had one person ask me to do that, and I was like, you don't want me to howl. <laughs> I would be goofy. Anyway, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I have beaten this game on at least three occasions. Four, maybe, it depends what you count as beating it. But there's plenty of time to go into those various stories as we go through the game. This is going to be a long one, people. This is uh, not a short game. It's, it's, I'd say it's longer than Diablo 2, probably. Yeah, in my opinion, I, I found this game to be far superior to Diablo. That's one of the reasons why I wanted to play through it. Yeah, I always so. considered it Diablo 2.5. <laughs> Yeah, I just I, it looks better. It's gorgeous, and mm -hmm. from what I understand, there's more than just the Greek setting. You go all the way to like Jap or Japan and stuff like that too, or is it China? Mm -hmm. It's got a lot of different areas that you go through f through the course of the story. Oh yeah, and so. uh, all the areas are pretty beautifully designed. Uh, oh, here's something. Also, people, we're going to actually be listening to the story as we go through so that uh, might make things a little longer but hopefully you will be interested in the story I know that I'm kind of interested in that I never had the patience to hear it before and this is the first time for Wolfman he was mentioning and, so. and I'm a stickler for like identifying everything so if there's a guy to talk to like this boat hand here yeah uh, I'm gonna talk to him and I'm gonna listen to it <laughs> all right <laughs> so like, yeah I like doing that so <laughs> sorry everybody yeah. If you absolutely need it, I can put little stiplets in the video to say, skip if you don't want to hear guys speak. Yeah. But just and let me know in comments if you want that to happen. Yeah, as I've always said, just skip ahead if you don't care, people. Because I'm going to listen to the story. So, okay, so let's go three, two, one, click on the guy. You're there, soldier. If you've come looking for rest and peace, you won't find it here. Our village has recently been beset by satyrs and other vile beasts. The help of your fighting arm would be greatly appreciated. Our farmers cannot get to their fields and our supplies are running low. Please, 
Go down the road toward the village and help where you can. <laughs> I love how my character has like a tiger claw thing. I don't know if anybody watches Jackie Chan much. Looking at the hands though, they got that little finger thing, the hook. Mm. <laughs> it's just like... Oh, my character got tired of posing. He just kind of yeah, like, ah, forget that. <laughs> my arm got tired. Let the, <laughs> let her do it. <laughs> okay, so it sounds like they need our help down here. That Oh, wait. One, two, three. Click on the guy. You must have been saved by the gods. Please, in the field here, they're going to kill my horse. Well, we can't let that happen. <laughs> Hurry. Does the horse attack? Oh, I have to hold the button down. Yeah. It's only that boar is not looking my direction. Man, I need I definitely need a better weapon. What did the they drop they dropped a spear here if you want that. Why am I not seeing it? Uh oh, you I'm have to hit Z maybe? Yeah. Did you need it? No, no. I'm gonna use like swords, so this dagger will be fine. For better. <laughs> yeah. Oh this is an attack well we'll see what it's like. Three, two, one. You saved Talk my horse. Guy. Yeah. Thank you. But I'm not the only one in trouble. Down the road there, that's my village, Kilos. We've got monsters at the gates, in the fields. They're everywhere. All right. It sounds like uh, we saved a horse. Now we have to save a village. Everything is looking bleak. Okay, now I just... bet next we'll, I don't know, save a country, then a world, then the galaxy. It'll work out. <laughs> I was hitting right-click the whole time trying to attack things. I was like, why am I not attacking anything? Oh, here's another guy. <laughs> Three, two, one, people. Hello, I am Ason, guard captain for this small village. We are holding up, but what's the use? If the monsters lay waste to our farms, we're lost all the same. It's that cursed shaman. Diomedes, he's tearing his hair off. Diomedes. I love Greek names. They're awesome. Yeah. This is the fountain you were talking about, right? Uh, yeah, but I meant, like, not the one in the village. <laughs> Obviously, this oh. would be a very short set. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Three, two, one, people. <laughs> the waters within these fountains are blessed by the gods. They say when you touch the water, your soul drinks from it. Should you suffer the dark fate in battle, your body will return to the fountain, and you may live to fight again. Very convenient. Yeah. Things like that around. Why me. doesn't everybody just drink from the fountains? Actually, I've I've got a small answer for that. Possibly, I think like that maybe only worthy warriors or heroes can actually make use of the fountains. Enough gods. Yeah, something like that. Uh, Three, two, one. There's going to be a lot of that in sessions where we hit a oh, town. Yeah. Inspire me to speak of the mightiest hero ever known, son of Zeus, a god, and of a mortal woman, the man named Heracles. Hated by the goddess Hera and beloved of Zeus, mighty-handed Heracles battled monsters great and fearsome. The Nemean lion he slew, and the Hydra many-headed. The Eremanthian boar and thunderous giants. Twelve tasks of legend did he perform. Heracles rose above the realm of mortals. Once, it is told he took the place of Atlas, who holds the world aloft. Heracles. Yes, Heracles bore the world itself upon his shoulders. And now, now, where is a hero half as great as he? I love Greek mythology. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I uh, I heard in a uh, in a review once that they were very proud in this game of like trying to search out the right authentic voice actors. Really? Uh, yeah. I th I think they fail a lot of the time, but whatever. <laughs> Let's see who else we have to talk to here. A couple shopkeepers. Here. Oh, here this this caravan is uh, new to the, uh, what do you call it, uh, expansion. The expansion? Yeah, I don't remember ever seeing something like this before. Yeah, this is an area where we can store stuff that we can't use yet, or just want to keep for some other reason, I suppose. Oh, well, you can extend it for 10,000. 
Yeah. Which we have nowhere near. And this is a shopkeeper. You're going out there, don't go and prepare. <laughs> I don't remember ever seeing a guy like this before. Buy what you need here. Nah, I don't have any money, so I'm just gonna yeah. do what I normally do in Diablo and rely on item drops that I normally get. Yeah, I'm for now. Somebody to talk to with a dog. Ah, uh, yes. These aren't quest givers, though, correct? They're just all talk. Right. If it's a quest giver, they'll have an explanation mark above their head rather than a diamond. Diamond is just for story and flavor. So, three, two, one. Here's some story. Monsters all over the village. They're burning and killing everything in their path. I've never seen such things in my life. The chaos and destruction, it, it is all too much for me to handle. I do like the voice yeah. actors in this game, though. Yeah. They're not, uh, they're not like, difficult to listen to. Yeah. Is, is there any secrets and stuff? Like, you can search barrels and things around town, or is this pretty mm, much it? Ooh, what is this? This is pretty much it. This, this here, though, this is a gate. We oh. can, uh, this is our town portal system. Uh, actually, uh, we'll walk over here. I hit the L button, and I can teleport right to the gate. Of course, you know, that would be pointless, since... Oh, you don't need to Actually, I'm, like I'm totally going to do it. I'm going to teleport right to the gate. Watch me do it, people. Watch me go. There, I teleported. <laughs> That's actually kind of cool. You don't need scrolls or anything like that. Oh, yeah. yeah. down here, too. Okay. One more, These one more guy to talk to. I guess he's going to explain this gate. As old as humankind, some say. Yeah. A very few still can. Those destined for greatness touched by the gods. Even fewer can travel to them with a simple stone as well. Or so the old tales claim. Alright. So quest giver now. Oh, and you're, it, does, it stays there forever now? Until you... Yeah, until I drop another one. Three, okay. two, one. Leave if you must, traveler. But we need your help. Strange monsters attack our farms. Please, speak with Diomedes back in the village. So, yeah, not a quest giver so much as a telling us, Go get the quest, you assholes! <laughs> Don't leave our village in peril! <laughs> okay, three, two, one. Hello, stranger. I'm Diomedes, the leader of this small village. Do you mean to say that you fought your way here? If that's true, then please, I beg of you. We need your help. Monsters led by a powerful satyr shaman appeared a few days ago and have driven us from our farms. We can hardly defend the village gates and have no one who can stop them from destroying our crops. Our farmland lies on the other side of the river, just over this bridge. The shaman was last seen beyond the farms at the edge of the Helos woods. Please, rid us of this terrible sorcerer. We will pay you what we can. Up. Oh. And conveniently, they're under attack as soon as that message <laughs> yeah. is over. Okay, so it only takes like two hits for me to kill one of these things now. Nice. I am going to grab this torch, actually. I think that'll be better than my dagger and any sword I find for a little while. Stop and picked up anything yet, so. Other than the spear. Now, does it pay? It, it pays to go and... Ex I, see, I don't remember anything about this. <laughs> Actually, interestingly, I found it doesn't so much pay to kill uh, everything. The But that is the method we'll use for the LP, because it's more entertaining to go and kill everything. Then my method was always to run by all the little stuff, get to, like, the new next boss area... And then kill him like three times, because he'd give as much XP as all the little stuff did. Plus, he'd give great loot, which these guys obviously are not. Wait, kill him three times? Yeah, I'd I'd like kill him, then I'd I'd save and load and kill him again, and oh. I'd I'd loot him a few times, and it was just quicker than going through all the little <laughs> grunts and whatnot. I'm but getting slaughtered. That method of gr oh my goodness, you are getting a little slow. Up this way, up this way. We gotta. Yeah, let me see. Is the torch better than my? Probably. It has fire damage, so I think it. Yeah. 